The King V said for us to come out there to that auction sale that they're going to have tomorrow. You want to go out there? The trouble is, Amos, we ain't got no money to buy no real estate. And in the second place, I don't think a thing is no good. He said that the Mystic Knights of the Sea owns this lot next to the golf club and they got to sell it. Maybe the mosquitoes is so bad on the water that's standing around there that the policemen is making them sell it. We ain't got no money anyway, I don't guess. But he says all of the members is going to be there, so I guess we better go out there. I'll bet you the water is standing on that lot three feet deep. You heard him tell us that if we could get some hip boots to put them on. Mm -hmm. I don't want to go out there and wait around in no water looking for no lot. Well, I do whatever you say. It certainly would be nice if we could buy something cheap and sell it for a lot of money, though. Listen, Amos. If you run that taxi cab and haul some people around here, we'll make some money. Answer the telephone. There's somebody that wants a taxi cab right now. Answer. Go yeah. ahead. Hello. Hello. Uh, the fresh air taxi cab comes in incorporated. Andrew Brown, president. Andrew Brown, president. I say this here is the fresh air taxi cab company incorporated. You want taxi cab? Where do you want it? I say, where do you want it? I can't hear you. Wait a minute now. Get the number. Get the number. What is your telephone number? We don't care nothing about the telephone number. We don't care nothing about your telephone number. Ah, it's Regustus. And it's Regustus. Wait a minute. Hold the phone. Some lady want a taxi cab, in. Well, what is the matter with you? Tell them that you get the taxi cab. Here we got a chance to make a dollar or two, and you is arguing about it. I ain't arguing about it. Well, talk to them. Get on the phone there. Hello? Hello? This year is the Fresh Air Taxi Cab Company Incorporated. Don't tell them that no more. Hello? Oh, this year is Amos talking. Who? Well, I've a dog gone. I didn't know it was you. How is you? Who is it? Who is it? Well, you must have been playing a little joke on me. But this young Ruby Taylor, Andy. Ruby Taylor. Uh-oh. There goes that love stuff again. How is you, Ruby? Now I know I was Augustus. What's that? You thought you'd play a little joke on me, huh? No, I didn't know who it was. No, I clear I didn't. How is everything? I got your picture in the room. And we ain't been bothered with mosquitoes since. And we ain't been bothered with mosquitoes since. I mean, uh, uh, well, wait a minute, Andy. What's the matter with you? Don't holler at me now. Hello, honey. I mean, hello, Ruby. Andy was uh, just talking to him and got me mixed up. Call the honey, huh? How is everything? You say, Rosie, we've got some flowers from Andy. Now, wait a minute. Tell her to keep her mouth out of my business. So, so, so Andy done sent Rosie with some flowers, huh? Well, she ain't got nothing to do with it if I did do it. Uh, he didn't tell me nothing about it, though. I was getting mad now. Andy say he's mad. With uh, Rosie Wade, I guess. No, I ain't mad with Rosie. Nothing of the kind. No, no, he said he ain't mad. I don't see why people can't keep their mouth out of my business. What's that? I can't hear you, Ruby. Oh, you been thinking about me? I've been thinking about you, too. You done forgot all about Mamie, ain't you? I done forgot all about Mamie. I mean, uh, wait a minute now, Andy. Wait a minute. Now listen, Amos. That's a business telephone. If you want to talk love talk, go out and use another telephone. Hello. What'd you say? You been thinking about me? I've been thinking about you, too. Wait a minute. Hold the phone. Andy, get away from here a minute, will you? I want to tell her something. I want to tell her something. Get away. Go ahead. Go ahead. Tell her. Hello. Can you hear me? I can't hear you. Say that again. I can't hear you, honey. What's that? Oh, yes, I do, too. I think about you all the time. I say, I think about you all the time. I think about you in the morning, and I think about you day, all day, and I think about you at night. No wonder you don't do no work. Why don't you think about the work sometimes? What's that? Hello. What'd you say then, Ruby? I get sick of listening to all this Tommy rot. Oh, you say you, you want to tell me something? Go ahead and tell me. No, no, tell me now, will you? Listen, Amos, listen now. Wait a minute, wait a minute, hold the phone. Don't keep on hollering at me now. Well, I've done told you that's a business phone. 
Well, let, well, let me talk. I don't care if it is a business phone. You sit around here all day and you use the phone whenever you want to. Mm. I pay half of the phone bill around here. Now, wait a minute. Hello? I was just talking to Andy there a minute ago. Go ahead now. The first thing you know, we'll be bankrupt. What's that? Go ahead, tell me, will you? Go, no, go ahead, tell me now, will you please? Tell her if she's going to tell you anything, just say it and get it over with. Uh, I, I, uh, I could tell you something, too. I say, I got something sweet to tell you. Love. That makes me sick, that kind of talk. Uh, hello. What's that? You couldn't go to sleep last night. Did you hear that, Andy? She said she couldn't go to sleep last night. Yeah, she must have been eating pig's feet or something. Hello. I'm going to tell you something, Ruby. Last night, I said, can you hear me? I said, can you hear me now? I said, this here is Amos, can you hear me? But listen, I'm going to tell you something. Are you listening? All right, now listen here. Uh, last night, I was sitting at home after Andy had gone to sleep. Uh, I said, I was sitting at home at, hello, can you hear me? That's why you can't get up in the morning. You sit up all night. Hello. I said, last night, I sit up for about an hour looking at your picture after Andy had done gone to sleep. You sit up and look at that picture like a dying calf. And I kept looking at the picture, and the more I looked at it, the wider week I got. Cut out that love talk now, Amos. Suppose somebody wants to call us up for a taxi cab. Uh, hello. Did you hear what I just said? You want me to say it again, huh? I will listen to this now. I say, last night, I sit up and looked at your picture for a long time. It certainly was sweet. I was getting sicker and sicker <laughs> this love talk now. What's that? You say you got something to tell me. Well, go ahead, tell me. No, I won't laugh at you. You say it's kind of silly. But that ain't nothing. Go ahead, tell me, will you please? Ah, that's right, Doctor. Wait a minute now, Andy. Wait, wait a minute. Uh, let, let me talk to the girl. Don't keep hollering. Hello. Hello, Ruby. Go ahead, tell me what you're going to tell me, will you please? I'm listening. Mm -mm. Say that again, will you, honey? Andy, she says she's in love with me. Uh-oh. Hello, Ruby. I was in love with you, too, honey. I didn't want to tell you, but I is. Cut out that love talk around here. Now on the telephone. What is going on around here? Hello, Cut honey. Out. Wait a minute. Hello, Ruby. Hello. Hello.